breakfast was accompanied by a panel of legislators in Baxter today. The Brainerd Lakes Chamber of Commerce held its annual Eggs and Issues Breakfast to discuss legislative priorities among more than 30 chambers across the state. Our Chelsea Brown tells us more. After Tuesday's caucus, the discussion still continues in the Brainerd Lakes area regarding legislative progression at the annual Eggs and Issues panel. So we can hear from our legislators on the issues that impact the business community and to really let our voices be heard in that whole process. With numerous business leaders in attendance, reducing property taxes was a major concern. Surveying across the country, Minnesota ranks the second highest for business property taxes. The businesses make up approximately 12% of those paying and they wind up paying over 30 percent of the property taxes in the state of Minnesota. That's not fair. I think that the businesses here were at least they felt like the, the growth was moving in the right direction, that they were heading that direction, but they wanted to make sure we paid attention to some of the things that could prevent that. Part of the conversation included a live text vote where guests were asked where they would put their savings if business property taxes were reduced. A majority selected facility improvements and employee benefits, which reassured many representatives the importance of helping small businesses. It reaffirms that, that these guys all know that we're overtaxed, we're overregulated. The government is just keeps keeps meddling more and more and more, and, and those that were here want less and less. To add to that list of priorities was securing bonding support for the Cuyuna Mountain Bike Trail expansion. The expansion would add over 50 miles of new trails with the project, expected to increase annual economic impact by $21 million. Once it's funded, and eventually it will be, it's going to bring more people into the community, but they'll stay longer too. They'll have longer lodging stays and and that really benefits us all because tourism benefits us all. Killian explained it is important that the community attend these events so they can voice what they want to happen. In Baxter, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. Other topics on the agenda included improving transportation in the area, consistency in wages and benefits at the state level, and preventing lawsuits for disability access. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.